Hi everybody! How's everyone doing out there? We sure all doing fine. You know what? I am so glad to share this lesson with you again, my dear pupils. I hope this will be helpful for all of you. But before we start, I want everybody to sing this action song with me. Is that clear? Okay. In five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, and one, and a one, two, three, two, three, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, and one. Once more. One, two, three, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, and one, and a one, two, three, two, three, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, and one. All right, so that's a little bit exhausting, but very nice song, isn't it? Agree? Yes, of course. So, my dear pupils, does any one of you know how to count the numbers one to ten? Wow, that's great! And what are the numbers that you already know? One? Mm -hmm. Five? Mm -hmm. What else? Two? Wow! I guess some of you knew it already because today we're going to speak about counting numbers. Mm -hmm. Yes, numbers. So when we say counting numbers, these are numbers that use for counting objects or things like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and so on. But this time, we'll only discuss the numbers 1 to 10. Is that okay? Okay, now I'm going to introduce you the numbers 1 to 10. Are you excited? Whoa, that's great! Okay, so the first number is, of course, your favorite number one. Okay, so repeat after me. One. One. Very good. Okay, so when we say one, it means it represents a single object or thing. For example, I have... What is this? Carrot. Very good. Okay, so I have a carrot. Now, how many carrot am I holding? You're right. It's only one. Okay, so that means one is just a single thing or a single object. Okay, it's not more than one. Am I clear? That's good. Okay, so let's proceed with number Two. Okay, very good. Number two. So when we say two, it is more than one. Okay? It is more than one or it represents two objects or things. Like, ta -da! Okay, these are eggplants. Okay, so how many eggplants am I holding? Okay, kids, please help me to count. One. Two. So, how many eggplants am I holding? Two. Very good. So, that is number two. It represents two objects. Yay! Okay, so next is number three. Okay, once again, three. Three. Okay, so now three means it is more than two. Okay, for example. Ta -da! Okay, so these are limes. Okay, will you help me to count? Okay, one, two, three. How many? Three, very good. So that is number three. Am I clear? Wow, that's great. So let's move on to number four. Okay, very good. Again, four. Four means four objects or four things. For example, these are popsicle sticks. Okay? 
So, how many popsicle sticks am I holding? Okay, let's count. Everybody, one, two, three, four. So, how many? Four. Very good. So, that is number four. It represents four objects. Get it? Very good. Moving on to number five. Yes, you heard it right. Five. Okay, one more time. Five. Five. Okay, so when we say five, it is a group of five objects or it is more than four. Okay, like, ta-da! I have string beans here, okay? So these are string beans. Now, would you help me to count this? Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. So how many string beans do we have here? You're correct, five. So that is number five. Okay, so next number is we have six. Very good, one more time, six. Good, now let's count this object. By the way, these are chocolates, okay? Okay, so kids, let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, so how many chocolates do we have here? You're right, six. Okay, so that is number six. It means it is more than five or it represents six things. The next number is we have seven. Repeat after me, seven, seven. Very good. Okay, so it is a natural number that represents seven objects. Like, ta -da! Okay, so we have popsicle sticks again here. And kids, I want you to help me count these popsicle sticks. Okay, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so how many popsicle sticks do we have here? Yes, you're right. Seven. Okay, so that is number seven. Understood? Very good. Next, we have number eight. Okay, repeat after me. Eight. Okay, so now kids, help me to count the subjects. Okay, so by the way, these are cotton bikes. Okay, everybody. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Okay, so you're right. So we have eight cotton buds here. Am I right? Very good. Okay, so that is number eight. It is a natural number that represents eight objects. Okay, so moving on to number nine. 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 Nine? Yes, nine. Okay, so nine means it is more than eight. Okay, for example, we have chocolates here again. Okay, so everybody, let's count this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so we have nine chocolates here, right? Yes! So that is number nine. And the last one is, of course, we have number ten. Yay! So ten means ten objects or ten things. Okay? Example, we have string beans again here. Okay? These are string beans. All right? Now, let's count this as string beans. Are you ready? Very good. Okay, let's get started. One two three four five six seven eight nine ten so that is ten it means it represents ten objects or ten things okay so that is number ten and now my dear pupils please listen and repeat one, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And, wow, excellent! So that's all for today. And kids, keep learning, keep growing. I'll see you soon.